Hey Cats fans, welcome back to The Hope Show, the number one Geelong fan channel. You're watching the last time series where I analyse our performances from last year. I'm your host for this series, at Kieran Fields, my Twitter is on the screen. I talk about YouTube, boxing, health and the Geelong Cats. This week, it's the last time we played the Western Bulldogs. For the Cats, close number of them. Gee, that's a risky kick. Bruce was held out of it beautifully by Colin Jasny. Uh, Stewart's kick was cut off by Liver. Could have gone the handball to Hannon. Went himself with a long ball. And the dogs draw first blood. Hawkins going to come at him eventually to the boundary, I would have thought. Wanting it long now. So Isaac Smith obliges long and low. And Cameron able to break the hold there and lead out strongly. Mitch Duncan is out of the game. Sean Higgins coming in obviously no good try just tape up that knee no good he immediately clutches the right knee Hughes Selwood thumping handball Isaac Smith radical in look out run down by Daniel handballs it inside 50 clever from Dalhouse flicked it back to Menegola Flying shot is going through. Brilliant. So this will be looked at for sure. The doctors are already out in the ground, and when they see the vision of that, they will be ripping him off and making sure all is well. Henry with the spoil. Bontem Pally quite brilliant. The turn and the kick is just absolutely superb. And some players around the stoppage. McLean, uh, McCray, I should say, was brilliant. Smith. High and long, but Henry, very good intercept player. Goes back, and it's a break up from Joe Hannison. Can he pick the ball up and get around views? The snap from Joe Hannison is going through. That is superb. Close there as well. So is Liberatore. Keith eventually tracked it down. Liber. What a great handball that was. Fantastic. Got it there to Scott, and they go forward once again. Johannesson, very, very wide. Bruce takes a nice mark. Was it completed in the field of play? Yes, it was. Okay. Play on. That is a play on around the body. It's coming back. Beautifully done. Josh Bruce with a magnificent ball. Follow Jasny Stewart again. Henry goes to ground. The ball was a little hot for him. Bontempelli with Tui chasing him. Great chase and tackle from Zach Tui. Oh, wow. That was sensational. Long penetrating ball. Rowan hands to it. Couldn't hang on. Dale dispossessed. Close. Cameron against the line. Hawk. And that's a goal. Brilliant. Tommy Hawkins. Daniel, Crozier, had to tap it back to Daniel, it was a little fierce, Dangerfield went and got it, shoveled it out there, Cameron, G. Guthrie flicked it out magnificently, Dalhouse gets another look, the little sideways bender, catch on fire. Hannon, Siren's going to beat everyone you sense, good half a footy, players dinged everywhere, Norton, Hands and knees, Crozier hobbling. Maybe, maybe Winded had got a real knock in the guts or rib cage there. Rourke Smith did really nicely. He did. Shifted the handball in favour of Scott, and he's able to get it over the top. This gives Bruce a chance to Stewart. A rare. Little mistake there, and what a kick. I'm not sure he was actually going for goal, but we'll give it to him. He shocked himself for his third. Numbers at ground level. Wallace, a nice touch. Hannon tumbles it inside 50. Dangerous ball here. Really dangerous ball for the Cats. Bruce, lovely handball. Scott kicks the goal. Good vision back inside, couldn't quite make the kick work, O'Connor. And bang, the Cats immediately to centre half forward. Cameron forcing the contest, the spill to Higgins, the run by Parfit needs to steady the little banana to finish. Here is and it's going to continue, I think. McRae just tried to shovel the handball. 
So dangerous, Bontempelli with some space on the left. That is through. Oh, here, 43 seconds. Isaac Smith back into Selwood. Neat ball here to, to Cameron. Wants to go, does, winds up. Hawkins has got the one on one. Marks plays on radically. Beautiful pick up by Stewart. He rips it straight up the gut. Rowan's got to be strong. Off hands, Menengola. A bounce out of the middle of the ground. A high ball. Throws it on the boot. It's a foot race. Cameron and Keith. It worked well for him. Well done, the Cats. Bailey Williams, little handball wide. Liberatore, neat kick inside 50. Got to get it on the bounce, Bruce. Got it. Looks to give. Does. Johannesson, what does he do? Finds Daniel. So the best and fairest of last year. Just milks an extra metre. Good looking ball. That's a goal. Scores a level again. It was the one that caused it, but... Not a lot in that, if that's the first time it popped up. Five minutes to spend those four inches wisely. Tui, if they got the right players on the ground to finish the last few minutes. Dangerfield to Selwood. Selwood a run. Could have gone the second bounce. Decides to kick it in the slot. Who can break free? Minicola. Cats fans jump on the back here. Straight through the eye. Diddle diddle. The Cats lead. English Blitzarves. Ground level of Blitz. And also again Liberatore. How brilliantly has he done that tonight? Bontempelli, overlap runner. Wobbles it inside 50. Worried out of the hands of Collagesny. Kick forward by McLean. Got it! As hard as he's ever been. They're out here, the Cats. Here they go. Dangerfield with a low ball. Delhouse trying to get his man. Cordy under the footy. Cordy did well. He did really well getting it away. But I think it's going to come back. Guthrie with a little win here to Smith. Smith's got numbers ahead of the footy. Good mark held by Rowan. Here we go. We say it all the time. You lie in bed as a kid hoping that this moment comes to you. Gary Rowan. The game on his boot. What's he got from the set shot? It's coming oh. back! It's through! He's won the game for Geelong! Unbelievable! Great kick at the end there from Gary Rowan to win us the game. You love to see it. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm not re really too um, worried about this game this week. Um, I'm predicting a 20 to 30 point win, probably a 30 point win. Um, let me know what you think about this, but I think, um, because SDK is performing so well so far this year, I think we can keep Mark Blitzarves in the, in the ruck, and, um, I honestly think we should, we should drop Stanley, uh, just because he's, of his inconsistency. Um, our team has changed quite a bit as well, um, since last year, um, and this will obviously be the case for every game this year, but um, that that's also my reasoning as to why I'm not, not too worried about this game. Um, I'm not saying it's going to be an easy game, uh, but I think we'll we'll get the job done. Um, us, us small forwards as well are just playing really well this year. We didn't really have um, that last year, uh, so I think that's also quite a big change uh, for us. Um, and yeah, that's that's about it really. Um, we could see in that game our defence was a bit unorganised. Um, there was a lot of um, unlucky uh, ball movement that happened. Um, but our overall performance um, wasn't too bad. Um, they were a good team last year. Um, they're still a good team this year. Um, but I think I think we're a better team um, in this case. Um, as well as that. I think I think we're on the right track now um, to to make it into the top four. 
um, if we, yeah, obviously we've got a few things that we need to work on, but um, I'm quite happy at the moment with our performance. Um, so yeah, thank you all for, for watching. Um, make sure you subscribe to the channel, like the video, um, as well as follow me on Twitter at Kieran Fields, um, and I'll see you all next week.